On the ice, set to go, Tanith Belbin, Ben Augusto of the U.S. You may know their story. She's from the Montreal area. He's from Chicago. They should be looking forward to making a run at the Olympic podium, but they're in a race against time to acquire her citizenship in order to travel to Torino. The highs of their career are undeniable. For the first time since 1985, you've got an American team on the podium at Worlds. They've emerged as a major force on the world scene. But for all their success, they are still being held back. The red tape and lengthy process of becoming an American citizen has cast a shadow over their skating. With the Olympics only four months away, their time is running out. What we're trying to do now is kind of like a last-ditch effort. We have to know within the next month and a half whether or not this is going to happen. Otherwise, we won't have time to move forward with the rest of the process. Tanith began her quest for U.S. citizenship in 1998. Since then, the rules have been changed and the process shortened. Ironically, if she had waited longer before applying, she might already have her citizenship. Learning about this process that I kind of got skipped over. It's unfortunate that I was only a few months away from, from being able to uh, be a part of this more streamlined process. We're not really asking for special treatment and we understand that the rules and the laws are there for a reason and we've never wanted to butt in line or ask anybody to treat us differently and if anything we're just asking to be treated the way they would treat people now. It's one of skating's rare scenarios, the two-time U.S. national champions not being allowed to represent their country at the Olympics. And if that's the case, this will be the second Olympic Games that they will miss. Skating can be a very emotional and stressful sport. It just gets to be too much of a gamble when you start thinking that if I don't win this competition, you know, so much is going to crumble in my life. I think that's helped us deal with this Olympic situation, knowing that there are no end-alls in skating. We just want to do our best and be able to go skate. We obviously would love to represent the United States and go to the Olympics and hopefully be able to place very well. I think that our goal this season is to obviously win the World Championships and be the first team ever to do that. Olympics or not, that goal remains the same and we're just looking forward to a great season.